What's going on YouTube? Card Kid here, back in with a video after a couple of weeks of being off. Um, haven't really gotten much in, haven't found a lot of things that I've been interested in, in terms of the hobby. Um, I have a few cards here. Let's see, I got one, two, three, four, I got five cards, and uh, one magnetic. Um, all from eBay, just some various pickups for the sets and collection. Um, and some other hobby news, 2012 Top Series 1 came out the other day. Looks like it's going to be another strong year for the hobby. Um, I am looking forward to 2012 Tops Archives, which comes out in May, uh, late May of this year. Um, I did really like when Tops Archives came out in 03 and 04. I wasn't into the hobby then, but um, I think it's going to be another strong product uh, that comes out. Also, 2012 Tops uh, 2012 Prime Cuts comes out from Panini. Um, another fantastic product that came out in 2008 is being reborn with the new uh, Panini license with CMG Worldwide, which gives them licenses to a lot of the great old timers, including like Babe Ruth, Jimmy Fox, Shoeless Joe Jackson, Walter Johnson, Ty Cobb, and many others. Um, but enough hobby talk. Let's get into some of the cards that I purchased. Uh, this first one is a nice 2008 Upper Deck OPG Babe Ruth card. It's just a real nice uh, looking insert of him. It's a nice black and white shot. Yeah, I think it was like a dollar shipped. Why not? Then we got this 2003 Fleer Tradition Mini of uh, Vladimir Guerrero. Future Hall of Famer. I have a bunch of inserts of his. Uh, but I'm um, Figured for like $2 shipped, number to 500 it was a good deal. And if you guys couldn't tell already, I am using my new camera with much better quality this time. So from now on, I should be using this camera for uh, most of my videos. So cheers to that. And then these next three are all for my set. Um, this is a 2002 Topps Team Legends reprinted autograph of Don Larson for my Topps Team Legends set. Um, nice on-card blue sharpie. And the 1956 tops look. And then we got this uh, Bill Scourin tops Team Legends autograph. And the 1967 tops look. In his White Sox uniform, which is really nice. Nice on-card blue sharpie again. With uh, career stats. So I really like that one. And then, uh, for the 1997 Donruss Power Alley die cut set, and it's like my fifth or sixth out of 24, so slowly moving along, picked up this uh, Manny Ramirez. And uh, these cards are absolutely stunning. Bringing back the inserts of the 1990s. So very, very nice card there. That is numbered uh, 199 out of 4,000. And each of these ones, there's only 250 of the die-cut die cut version, so uh, very happy to pick up that card for my set. So uh, there's quick five uh, cards that I picked up from eBay in the last couple weeks. Hope everyone enjoyed, and uh, thanks for watching. Should be back at you guys with another video here in the coming days. Got a few more cards coming in from eBay. So uh, that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.